Katie, I mean, it's scary how much we as humans can impact the weather. I know though right now here in the borderlands, pretty nice weather, especially for our trick-or-treaters who are gonna head out this afternoon. Give us a look at exactly what they're gonna be experiencing if they're in full costume or just the nice cool get together. What, what's it gonna be like? <laughs> yeah, sure thing, Rachel. And the only thing that's gonna be affecting our weather are the creepy ghosts that are gonna be flying around. They might make it a little bit cool later tonight, but it's also cool right now. 60 degrees though in El Paso, 48 in Las Cruces. 50 out there in Alamogordo and 49 in Sierra Blanca. We are in store for a fairly warm afternoon and this is several degrees above where we should be at this time of year. So we're going to reach about 80 degrees here in El Paso, 78 in Las Cruces, 77 in Alamogordo, 78 in Tier C and 75 in Sierra Blanca. So a fairly warm afternoon and our warm temperatures are going to stay in place. Check this out. We're going to be several degrees above our average high for the next several days. Then we'll have a cool down on Thursday before we start to warm up once again by the end of this week. Our latest future track model is not showing much. We're going to have very pleasant conditions today. Not going to be tracking any rain at all. The only thing we'll be tracking are some clouds that are going to be pushing in from the west to the east all afternoon. So by 12 o'clock, we should start to be seeing those clouds out there. And when you're headed out to go trick or treating, once again, we might have some clouds overhead, but Honestly, what's so bad about any clouds? It might keep our, t our temperatures a little bit cooler, but I still expect many locations to be reaching 80 degrees today. By 11, I do think most of those clouds will be pushing off to our east, but you know, we s could still have a few stragglers out there. Here's what your Halloween day looks like. So in the middle of the day, temperatures are gonna be in the upper 70s, possibly warming up to the low 80s for many of us. Then by the end of Halloween day, at least we'll be reaching the middle 70s. So we'll have increasing ghosts, I mean clouds out there as I talked about that before. And I do think if you are gonna be trick or treating, at least midday your candy might melt, but overnight candy should not be melting. This is what you could expect this evening, 71 by 7 o'clock and then 65 by 9 o'clock when you're ending your trick-or-treating. So it could be a little bit cool out there. A very wonderful, haunted, happy, warm Halloween. 79 for your Monday, 78 for Dia de los Muertos, 77 for Wednesday. And then once again, that cool off between Wednesday and Thursday before we warm up by the end of the week.